All right, welcome everyone. We are Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we're here for Hebe Hebe Euphonium Season 2, Episode 11. Asuka Senpai is back. She's back, yeah. Guess who's back? Back again. Back again. Yep. Uh huh. She yeah. apparently managed to score in the top 30 nationally for college entrance exams. Yep. Okay. Yeah, so All right. she's going to be doing just fine as far as schooling. Mm -hmm. And uh, both, her mother both had no, no reason to yep. kick her out of this in mm -hmm. any logical sense. Right. Of course, she's not happy about it, but Asuka's mm -hmm. going to get to be able to play for her dad. Yeah. And that's going to be really special for her. <sighs> okay. Yeah. yeah. So, y'all, without further ado, let's get into this. I really hope this show gets a season three. Like, maybe it... I mean, depending on where it ends, it might not necessarily make sense for there to be a season three, you know? Right, it's probably like, why it got two movies, yeah. Right, right, exactly. If, if they do nationals and that's it, then, like, you know... Well, also, like, kind of the when you do place. one movie, that's usually the end, you know? Mm -hmm. But when you do a second movie, that's probably just, like, the, ah, this is the uh, the spinoff with, like, you know... Right. Because I know stuff, one of them don't actually focuses... continue the plot, you know? Right, because one of them focuses fashion. on side characters. Yeah, exactly. So that, that, There you go. There's your answer. Yeah. But, yeah, if the studio gets fully revitalized, maybe in, like, you know, a few years or so. Yeah. But I think they've got a lot of other anime that, like, mm -hmm. definitely could go into that, like, gorgeous just example of our, right. you know, you know, yeah. visual presentation capacities, like Violet right. Evergarden, you know? Yeah, they can recreate this just fine, even if it's with a different story and characters and all that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, in some ways, Violet Evergarden is, is right, right. literally like <laughs> yeah, that. Yeah. It's just yeah. better, you know? It's just crazy. <laughs> crazy good. Yes, good to admit that. Mm. Oh, <笑><笑><笑><笑> Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We still need to deal with that. Yeah. Last stretch. Ooh. That hesitation. Uh huh. Oh boy. First love trumpet. Oh boy. Oh boy. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> that I love how Kumiko is like. <laughs> God. I love how easily she moves while carrying Yeah, yeah, chest. it is. It is impressive. <laughs> and she poked it with one hand. <laughs> Strategy meeting. Yes. I love it. Nagagawa. <laughs> ありがとう。かっこ悪いわ。嬉しいです。先輩の格好悪いところ。いや。ほとんど見たことなかったから。Because Oh my god. They're using the OP little yeah, box yeah. Uh -huh. too. Uh -huh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> no. Just <laughs> for a little bit. I have a little bit of time. I have a little bit of time. Whoa. I'm not saying that I'm not saying that. But... I'm going to get out of here. <laughs> Classic. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> Too busy talking. Mm -hmm. Wow. Damn. Good for her. Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice. 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 Mm. 
Got it. Cool, cool. All right. Yeah. Hey. Nice. I hope you have better shoes for this now. Yeah. <laughs> Not carrying the youth probably helps, though. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, because you didn't say anything. Yep. There, that's my yep. feelings. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Feel a bit better? Usually not that much. <laughs> it happens might have to do it a few more time. times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Ah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's it's sweet because you know Reina's kind of a child in this regard. She she doesn't really right. think about the yeah surprised yeah, yeah. by her own weakness. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> So she could move on properly, yeah. Right. Makes sense. Oh. Okay. okay. That's really sweet, because that's not really... Like, there's not really much that Kumiko can do here. Right. So yeah. just being able to be there and say, I support you, you know. Oh. Okay, Reina backstory, yeah. All right. Oh my god, she's so mm -hmm. cute! Yep. Oh my god! Yep. Yep. Where'd the scrape on her knee come from? Ah. Uh, it's the very childhood crush kind of like, whoa. Uh -huh. Yeah. Like she's more just enamored that there's like this, this mm -hmm. amazing musician that right. like... もびあがっていくような音ですね。いらしてたんですか。先輩には周りの音を聞いてないって怒られるんですけど。確かにそれも。Oh, so of course she'd fall for him. Wait. あなたにぴったりだと思います。ふう。弱い。弱いです。全然弱い。すぐに立て直してください。ごう。オッケー。H but it just sounded so sad. Might have been just because he was ending that note. Yeah. Yeah. Or maybe when she's in front of him, you know? Mm-hmm. But I do care about you, you know? Like, mm -hmm. I mean, yeah. You know. Whoa. She's playing all day into the night. Yeah. Jeez. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Oh no, 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 no. This is. Oh. Wow. Of course. Oh, 
よく笑って体を動かすことが大好きで。Course, he's hitting the picture, girl. 体が丈夫なのが取り柄だと言っていました。Yeah. Oh, jeez. Okay. Wow.、Uh. 全国を目指すと言っていたんですよ。だから。ああ。Uh, wow,、mm-hmm. that is such、and、a cool five way to years ago. It. Yeah, yeah, exactly. His mind went blank and everything happened in an instant. Like, he's thinking back on it. It's just all、mm-hmm. nothing. Yep. Oh. Oh. Probably somewhere in there, yeah. Yeah. But we can't know for sure, yeah. Yeah. Yep. So, <sighs> Oh, that was, that was the closure she needed? Yeah. And she's back to normal now with. Whoa. All right. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry. That's me. Where are y'all going? All right. What's, what's the plan? Bike, bike trip? Bike. To the dam? Okay. Wait, they're going to a cemetery. Oh, they're going to a cemetery, yeah. Yep. Yep. There's the flowers that he bought. Yep. Mm, the sun.、Mm-hmm. Yep, yep. All right.、Uh, there's a confident smile. Yeah. Ah, it's a beautiful sound. Yep. Okay. All right. That was, was an like, amazing shot. I was like, what, 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 were you, what were we going to do there? <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. <sighs> all right, all right. Okay. okay. Sweet. Really, really, really quiet, slow episode、mm-hmm. for kind of processing feelings and. Oh, yeah. I'm really glad that, of,、uh, that Reyna specifically、yeah. called Kumiko out and was like, hey, so we need to talk, you know? Yeah, and then it also became a thing of where. She then kind of relies on Kumiko to be kind of the focus point for when she processes her emotions regarding it. Because I'm guessing,、yep. because she was so frustrated with、uh, Kumiko, she wasn't actually able to process her feelings regarding the situation、yep. in、exactly. and of itself. You know. Right. Oh, yeah. And we also got kind of, kind of what I wanted a little bit with、um, Asuka. Asuka, and that she、yep. apologized to the entire club, but had,、uh, had a little thing of, you know, acknowledging that. You know, she kind of grew up a little bit because of that. And then、right. Kumiko being like, oh, oh yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then the talk with Natsuki.、Mm-hmm. Oh,、right. boy. Okay. All right. We got、well. ourselves some really good emotional stuff. We、yep. have some clarification, some、mm-hmm. uh, confrontation, and、yes. a bit of just, well, dealing with emotions. Rumination, I guess. On yeah. Feelings. Musings and stuff. Yes. And- Oh, because, because, I mean, it's, it's, it's the thing of where I, I totally understand where Reyna's coming from.、Mm-hmm. And yet it's like, you know, there was never、yeah. any chance, Reyna. It's, right. It's, it's, exactly. That's kind of and the point here. And that's, and that's why I'm really glad that they're, that they're handling it in this way because it's the.、Um, Reyna decided that she was, that her feelings were more than just a, a, a passing fancy infatuation、right. or whatever, that they were actually real love. Right. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, she had、that's, a lot of history with him. Right. Yeah, that's yeah. a very adult decision to make. Right. And, the, and it's fairly common for、um, teenagers or young kids, as you're, as you're become, starting to become an adult, you want to make adult decisions when you don't really understand the consequences、true. of those decisions, right? Very true. Yeah. And the consequences of Raina's decision is sorry, 
there is there is like n certainly no chance right now, but mm -hmm. probably no chance ever that ever. he will ever look at you that way. Given that when he first met you, you were a little like a little little kid. Mm -hmm. You know, he's he's always gonna see you that way probably. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But she chose to be in love with him anyways. Right. Right. Yeah. As a result of that, buckle up for heartbreak, girl. Right, because this is this isn't going to be easy. Right, it can yep. it can feel romantic and all that stuff, and the feelings themselves can feel great to feel. Yeah. But realize what you're in for, yeah. and that's what she kind of got here. And she wasn't able to handle it at first, and I love that she was surprised by how unable to handle it she was. Right. Yes, that was like, the part that I was, was the most surprised by my own well. weakness. Right. It's like yeah. yes, yeah, yes, yeah. That was that was really good because my my thought surrounding this was. Okay, what was the time, like, how can you relate to this, Kale? What was the time where you crushed on someone that was a lot older than you? Mm -hmm. And I'm like, uh, maybe, like, a babysitter, you know, like, uh -huh. when you're, like, nine. And it's just, yeah. like, <laughs> like, I can't really relate to it on the, like, serious level. Mm -hmm. Like, it was never something where <laughs> I'm like, oh, I am in love with this person. And I right. will, I will, I will stew in it. I will, I will, like... It reinforced the infatuation and the the, mm -hmm. the 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 crush into into a thing that is I I think called love, and, right? Because you know because you don't even fully know what that is. You don't even know age. what that right. is yeah. really. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and uh, in this situation, she's being more mature. Mm -hmm. Really. Yep. She's well directly going to Kumiko and being like, "Hey, I really wish you would have told me." Mm -hmm. You know. Why didn't you tell me? Okay, yeah, I, I kind of figured that's what it was. Yeah, exactly. All right. You know, it's yeah. it's showing that she's that she's even if it took her a while to get there, and maybe yeah. she needed the the sort of um catalyst of Kumiko, yeah. like waiting for her outside school, and then her lead, you know, like shutting her down and rejecting her. Mm -hmm. Maybe it took something like that for her to be like, okay, hold on, mm -hmm. am I really thinking about this maturely? Right. right. Yes, and in a lot of ways, that's kind of the best thing about Reyna's character mm -hmm. is that she's actually pretty straightforward. Yep. Her biggest weakness is her emotions. Mm -hmm. When she's swept up in them, she does some things that just don't make sense, and they are and, and they are not necessarily the, the 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 best decisions. And yet, she can learn from them. There's a lot that can come from her mistakes in that regard because they're not really like hard mistakes. They're right, more exactly. just like they're, they're more like little immature goof ups where it's like you're asking a guy about his dead wife, right? With no provocation, not provocation, uh -huh. but no like setup for it. You're right. just out of the blue, being like, "Tell me what your wife was like." Yeah, and he's just like, uh, uh, mm -hmm. uh, "She was right. a student here." No, 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 no. Tell me what she was like, and it's like. Yeah. You, Do you realize like, how, like, how, like... Yeah. The, in fact, it is probably a testament to to his history with your family yes, and, and the fact yes, that he knows you specifically. Exactly. That he's even entertaining this. Right. Because, other, because that's, oh my God. that's some, like... That's some, like, all right, just sh sticking the knife in the heart. Now, 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 twisting for a second, you know. Right, right. And, and let me twist, you know. Yeah, um, yeah. Just, just out of the blue, not telling you that I'm about to do this or anything. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. And... Uh, and yeah, and then Kumiko saying later, that probably wasn't the best idea. You know, like even just even just from his own you know response to it or whatever. If you don't want to ruin your chances, essentially, yeah, seriously, you don't want you don't him want to, to find out that you have feelings for him in that way because otherwise, you, like not until you are yeah. you know at least you know a good deal older, so that that way it doesn't he doesn't immediately just remember. Uh, no, I watched you when you were, you know, when you when you were like this tall, yeah, you know. Yeah. So, we get Reyna then, uh, well, in a lot of ways, coming to coming to grips with this, mm -hmm. and I, that's I'm, a sign I'm, of maturity. That's a sign of maturity. Yeah, I'm I'm really happy for her because this is something where she's going to still have that attraction to him. She's not yep. going to have that just magically disappear. Oh no, she can't choose that away. And in fact, the whole going to the cemetery was an example of the fact that she was still deciding to hold on to it, which which mm -hmm. again is um, uh, almost feels like a. A, a wonderful blend of of maturity and immaturity where it's the it's the stubbornness of being young right yeah while at the same time acknowledging the the the, the path set before you basically that is the, mm. the mature side of it right because sure because okay. she's still holding on to her feelings for taki right and mm. she's saying i'm going to I, i'm going to you know 
fulfill his dream that was also your dream, right? I'm acknowledging that he still loves you, right? Right. And I'm not going to let that negatively affect me. Yeah. In fact, I'm going to use that as additional motivation, as an empowerment to basically yeah. say, yeah, I'm going to make sure that this works well. Right. Because regardless, and this is where this is where I feel like Reyna was really starting to tap into the nature of love. Yes. Regardless of whatever his affections are for you, that does not change your affections for him necessarily. Yeah. And even if he doesn't end up liking you in that way or anything like that, you still want the best for him, right? Yeah. So this thing that's really important to him, it be, by proxy, it becomes really important to you. That's just kind of how it works, yep. right? And so, so okay, girl, you know, you, you go. Gambate. You, yeah. Gambate, you yeah. know, it probably won't get much better than this, but gambate. Yeah, yeah you, you go. I, mm -hmm. I, I'm really excited because what it is is that We've kind of ironed out the motivations from a from a writing standpoint mm -hmm. in that she has no conflict with regards to playing, performing, or interacting with Taki because it's all focused now on the goal of nationals. So it's right. simplified the conflict in the story. So a lot yep. of the drama of everything has been mm -hmm. moved aside. And this episode basically just got to have Kumiko kind of be the impetus or catalyst, as you said, uh, for making this come about because right. she was probably being a bit petty Oh, in, yeah, totally. uh, oh, I'm going to ignore you mm -hmm. until yep. that point comes. But then Kumiko reached out basically saying, no, I still care about you. What the hell? And right. she's like, oh, right. I'm being immature. And okay. then on top of uh, that, there's the yeah, whole let's, idea. Let's go. Let's interact. Yeah. Right. And then on top of that, there's the there's the fact that the the practicing for nationals and stuff wasn't working. And Taki was specifically yeah. calling her out. And it's like, what, what is this? What is this? You're like this is this is lazy. This is awful. This is weak. Like well, you know, yeah, she's one of the strongest players in the right. ensemble. So of course he's going to have high standards set for her because she right. sets high standards for herself. Exactly. It's the it's yeah. the I don't I can't remember the last time I heard you play this badly. You know like yeah. What is this? Yeah. Like, yeah. Did, did, like mm -hmm. are you okay? Do you need mm -hmm. to go home? Like are you sick? Like, are 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 you actually trying? Like yeah, yeah. Like there's the part of that 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 kind of had the barbs of like come on this is serious like buckle up you know right right. right. But then also the we're playing at nationals. Right, right. I've heard you play, so obviously you're not playing here. Right, right. Like, like, a, almost like a sincere question of, are, like, are you trying? Because right. this this doesn't sound like you trying. You know. Yeah, yeah, and that's good. Yeah, that's good. Um, there was a cool little bit with the Taki backstory alongside oh, yeah. the uh, uh, Reina backstory. backstory. Is that we see that he was a friend of the family since she was very little. Yep, which we had been told. Which we had been told. But we then get to see kind of what that what that meant. Mm -hmm. When she was younger, she kind of sees him as this like larger than life, just grand being that comes in and plays music and right. he's whoa and it's and it's, yeah, it's, it, it's yeah, yeah. It very much felt like the um, like the kind of thing of where like you know when I would have been like a like a little kid, right? And you see someone that's like a teenager, a teenager, and they're and by teenager I mean like they're fourteen, right? But or they, like you know, they, they've they've roached that five foot five, you know, kind right, of right, range exactly, of height but, where they're just like, whoa, they're so right, tall. they're basically a giant, right? Yeah. And you're like, you must have everything figured out, right? You know, right. and it's like. No, yeah, yeah. no, they, they, they don't, they don't. No. But, but because no. it's the you, you think of them in that high regard, right? Mm -hmm. Then, any time if they were to actually um, spend time with you, where yeah. they, where it seemed like they actually wanted to spend time with you, or, or they felt like, like they could see you as a peer in yeah. some way, like in say music, I don't know, yeah. for Reina, yeah. then that's that's a that's a big deal, right? Yeah. I, I remember multiple times when I was growing up that I would have friends who would have, like, younger siblings. Mm, sure. And there would be times when I remember there was a point when I got really tall all of a sudden. Mm. And I think that was around 16 or so. I grew, like, stupid fast in, like, 9, 10 months or something. And one of the younger brothers mm -hmm. of one of my friends just kind of had this thing. I'm just like, whoa. Because he, like, saw me. And he was just like, oh, my gosh, you're so tall. Right. And, uh... Throughout the time, I was hanging out with my friend at, at at his at his you know his folks' house and stuff like that. This kid would just be like, "Whoa!" Just kind of like enamored, there's and the there's like, like this like this 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 almost like hero kind of thing of just like, "Yeah, you're a big guy. Like, wow, that's so cool. And mm -hmm. You could run really fast. It's so cool." And 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 I think that on on some level, that's kind of the the equivalent of like. Um, 
you see this sometimes in like celebrity kind of things where they'll like oh, sure. get that like obsession of like oh you're so radiant and perfect and everything's amazing. Right, right, it's exactly. like hero worship basically. Yep. And I feel like I've seen instances of this where kids will basically latch on to this just person and just be like, whoa, you're the perfect, and wow, and right. and that's, crazy. And that's probably where all the teacher crushes come from. Right, that it's right. that same basic thing, but it's the, oh, you have everything figured out. You know, it's like, it's like, <laughs> And you're pretty, and you know, right? And, and you're and you're, and you're you pretty, know. and all that stuff. But then, but then, by comparison, when you see all the immaturity of of the people around your age, right. then it's like the uh, reality whoa, is often disappointing. Uh, whoa, <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Right. <laughs> and then Rain is like, reality can be whatever I want. <laughs> nope, didn't work. Didn't nope. work. <laughs> Wishing in front of a mirror, you know. Right. Anyway, um, but the part at the bridge. Mm -hmm. The part of the bridge where Taki uh, Gives brings, the, music the, brings the sheet music, that was after she his died, wife's I think. death, right? I think so. I, yeah, because yeah. he, he didn't have the ring on. But, he didn't have the ring. But given Reyna's age, she didn't. It didn't. She didn't seem she didn't to seem be that younger. That much younger than yeah. she is now. And she we know his wife to... died five years ago. So yeah, yeah, she definitely seemed to be at least like. I don't know, eleven or twelve or something. Right, right, exactly. At the so, very youngest. And, at the very youngest. And yeah. and I think she's a first year, so she's fifteen so she's right 15, now. Yeah. So her, his wife would have died when she was ten. Yeah. You know, which again, it's like Reina, no chance. No like, chance. No chance. No, no chance. chance. Like like even in ten Fettle. years, probably no chance. No chance. Like yeah. Sorry. So, it's just mm -hmm. no. Yep. Does doesn't work. But the idea that she noticed. Mm -hmm. The hand and that the ring wasn't there and then him handing the music to her and then finding out later that his mind went blank. Mm -hmm. And all I the time that after that. Passed in an incident. In, yeah, passed in an instant. Right. And now, this is essentially, <sighs> as far as we can tell, when Ugh. that instant ended five years later. Yeah. Right. Because now he's actually like, oh, yeah, I'll go back to the school where my wife went to school and I'll yeah. try and take them to nationals. Okay. So all this here mm -hmm. is basically him having come to grips right with the fact that he lost her. Yep. But but the fact that he basically lost 5 years of his life. Now, I don't think I don't think any of us, Jacob, I don't think either of us can really comprehend what that God, would be no. like. No. But I have to I imagine can try to imagine. But. Yeah, I have to imagine the closest thing to it, basically, would be that feeling of waking from a very long, complex dream that was sure. so beautiful and it was so wonderful and you wish you could go back to it, but it's gone, but even worse, you have a little bit of trouble remembering it. Yeah, the 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 closest thing I, I can think of is like what I what I can guess it would be like is the a similar fashion to like when when people say that like oh they grow up so fast you know and, oh yeah watching kids right and all of a sudden you yeah, blink and and, up, and yeah. they're all grown up right except it's for it's, it's teaching as from a the perspective of the parents right right but yeah. except it's as a result of something negative so yeah, you know yeah exactly so like so like if if say there was the there was the person who who drowned their sorrows in a bottle you know like uh -huh. you know or something like that right and they, right. you know they go to a bar every night you know and then all of a sudden five years pass right that's that's the kind of thing that comes to mind right and taki definitely seems like he uh as best he as held he possibly himself together can with something like part. that he took it in stride right <laughs> like as far as know, we can see yeah Right, like he looks healthy. Took it in that five years try. Right, 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 exactly. It's the idea that he went into his own hyperbolic time chamber, uh -huh. came out, and probably just he, he just, cocooned, just, just skipped you know. those years. Right, exactly. And, and that's so depressing because usually what that means is a lot of just days and nights alone. Oh, yeah. A lot of times where he's just not eating right, and sure. a lot of times where he's just, just, mm -hmm. just all sorts in a of days. Bad. Yeah. Now, and, he but, didn't want to touch music, though. Right. But the fact that he's back here wanting he's, he's to come through push that. them to this point mm -hmm. and set up the stakes, really, for, no, if you guys are Actually serious... Actually say you want to go to nationals, then I... Then we will go. Uh-huh. And right. now we have all the reasons behind that. So mm -hmm. I like that they duoed things with Taki. Which... Ooh. And the Reyna uh, bit here. In a in a fun way. Now, now this isn't... I, I'm almost positive this isn't exactly right. Okay. But 
Taki gave them the decision of whether or not they were going to go to nationals, right? right? Yeah, makes sense. That's the that's the good mature thing to do because you certainly can't force them to go to nationals, yep. right? If they Definitely. don't want to, they just don't want to, and there's nothing you can do sure. about that, right? But what do you think was going through Taki's mind when he gave them that choice? Mm. Because if you think about it, if this is his dream, if this was his wife's dream, it's kind of like a thing of a coin toss, mm -hmm. right? Will I actually move on? Will this be another year that I don't remember, right. right? Because I'm sure that if they were just wanting to play for fun, then yeah, he would have gone through that and all that stuff. But, but I'll bet you that him teaching them like this is also part of the therapy. It's like that 12th yeah. step, right? Where where all of a sudden he's teaching music to other people, right? That's yeah. how he knows that it's that he has it back for himself too, for sure. right? And what what made them choose to go to nationals? Mm. Eh, peer pressure, you know, yeah. some some random happenstance sure. chance. Okay. Serendipitous, you know, little little thing right. that happened. Yeah. You know, that caused a whole lot of chaos and things like that, but hey, what do you know? What do you know? This this guy may have actually been able to to do that final stage of the grieving process for his wife as a result of some dumb high school kids that were like, you know what? Everyone else seems to be raising their hand. I guess I will too. Sure. I don't know that. There's some I like, potentially there. Like I now will yeah. that conversation where it's revealed to be that oh, ever I don't think happen that'll in ever the happen. story? Nope. Don't I don't so. know what character it would need to be in order to yeah. pull that out of him and have it then come to the perspective of a character sure. in the wind ensemble. Right. So. Yep. But just just as a headcanon little little Maybe little thing. After they win nationals, you know? Sure. Yeah. yeah. Like I would love to see I would love yeah. to see Taki's perspective at some point of their journey along the way. Well, he could come back to this grave at the end of the season. Sure. There's almost a part of me that that was wondering if um, Raina was going to leave something at the grave. Well, it, yeah, if, if mm. basically there would be some kind of paths crossing because uh, of the grave, right? Because that's a very singular yeah. place. And yeah, you got to be really going there. careful about that, Raina. Uh -huh. that's, that's really yep. offensive if you're not being very, very conscientious. Because... Yep, 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 exactly, exactly. Oh, boy. Yeah, playing with fire. Mm -hmm. But... Yeah, yeah, cause, but I could see I could see him going to her, his wife's grave absolutely after they take nationals, if they do. If sure. they take gold at nationals, I should say. Um, and now Reyna and, kind of has a reason to and, as well. And Reyna does have a reason to as well. But she did, she did promise. Uh-huh, yep. So, y'all, here we go. Thank you so much for watching this episode's reaction and discussion. If you want to see the next episode's reaction and discussion right now, though, go check out the link in the description below for our Patreon. You can get an early access there. You can watch full-length timer reactions there, and all this comes with Discord access, so you can chat with us and the community there about this show, about anime in general, and also be sure to check out our Twitch channel. We stream every weekday. The info's in the description. Yeah, so if ain't that interests you, we'll see you there. But until then, we're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we'll see you all next time. time.